And breaking today, the Ukrainian government is now banning the export of key goods crucial for global food supplies to ensure, of course, that they can feed their own people amid this ongoing war. But that includes sugar, meat and wheat. Ukraine and Russia are some of the top producers of wheat. Together, the two countries export close to one third of the world's production. And as that war rages on, the prices of everyday staples like bread, could cost more. In just the last month, wheat prices have jumped 77-0%. News Nation's Nancy Liu is live for us. So, Nancy, this will potentially cause some major global export disruptions. Absolutely, Nicole. While a lot of people focus on record high gas prices, many Americans focused on the soaring cost of wheat and flour from major manufacturers to neighborhood bakeries to home chefs. The cost of baking pretty much anything costing more dough. For businesses like Bread Bar here in LA, which provides baked goods for many restaurants and hotels, this is a staple. But flour is getting harder to come by due to shifting global demand. The price of wheat has jumped by 24% in just the past week. What's the number one ingredient that we use is wheat flour. Um, and, and some of our very basic staple products. So when, when there's a short supply or there's disruptions in the supply chain, that, that gets felt by the bakers and, and ultimately by the consumer. Rob McKee is CEO of the American Bakers Association, where members are facing more competition for American wheat flour. Russia and Ukraine usually produce a third of the global supply, but the ongoing invasion has cut off their contributions. There's just going to be more competition for American wheat. It's great for the wheat grower. Like Doug Rebout in Appleton, Wisconsin, who has mixed feelings. His daughter was adopted from Ukraine in 2005. I don't like being able to profit from despair in another country, but it is the way the global market works. Now is the time that Ukrainian farmers would be planting their new wheat and grain crops, so the worldwide flour grab is expected to get even tighter. A 50 pound bag, we used to get it. 16, 17, now it's up to $21. Already felt at this bagel shop in Las Vegas, to Bread Bar in LA, and this family shop in Wisconsin. Well, you know, when it comes down to it, you just have to turn that price around to the customers, you know, and you, you don't like to do it. Now, according to the U.S. Department of Agriculture, before the Russian invasion, Ukraine was on track for a record year of wheat exports. Nicole? All right, Nancy, thanks. Thank you for watching. Click the red subscribe button below so you can get more of News Nation's fact driven, unbiased coverage.